Hi there, I'm Matt Phillips for TechRadar, and dark mode articles have been blowing up on the website lately, and our resident dark mode master Kat Ellis has been on top of it all, providing you with the latest updates and how-tos every day over on techradar.com. Now, let's face it, dark mode is one of the hottest new features to have in 2019. Everything from your phone to your email already has it, but does it save you time? Does it make you a quicker reader? Does it save you any battery? Is it any good for you and should you bother at all? Let's jump in and take a look. First question to answer is, where did dark mode come from? Dark mode has been around for a while, and whilst it's hard to say where it actually started, some argue it goes all the way back to 1991 with Apple's System 7. But the truth is, no one really knows. However, one thing is for certain, Dark mode is definitely reminiscent of old coding software. People have been writing code in a form of dark mode since computers began. And now that we're all clocking in coding like hours in front of our screens, perhaps dark mode is the way forward. Wherever it began, it's clearly here to stay. But why is it so popular? Dark mode started to become popular when must-have apps like the Adobe Suite started to adopt the style. Spotify was also another massively popular startup that pushed the popularity of the dark interface forward. At the end of the day, people just love options. That's why Apple are constantly flipping around what their standard colorway is. And maybe it's just a case of people being picky and preferring the non-standard or newer color. Maybe it's the irresistible call to the dark side. Whatever it is, the thing that everybody's arguing about online is whether or not dark mode is actually any good for you. So, what are the benefits of dark mode? Well, all we know for sure is that on some devices, dark mode can help save your battery, especially if that device has an OLED screen. If pixels need to be black on an OLED device, it simply turns the pixel off, meaning that it's not consuming nearly as much power as your typical LCD backlit display. Some people have also claimed that dark mode is easier on the eyes, but to be honest, the science and data is very mixed on this. It seems like this is true if you're in a low light situation where lots of bright white light can be jarring or straining on your eyes. But honestly, it's probably just personal preference. If you find it easier to read in dark mode, then go for it. It's probably not harming you. The chances are one isn't better for you than the other, so just go with whatever suits you. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're looking to enable dark mode on a specific device or app, then check the description. I'm going to dump in a whole load of articles from techradar.com and yours just might be in there. If it's not though, leave it in the comments below and I'll pass it on to our team and I'll try and keep that description updated as well. So check back every once in a while. If you like this video, remember to hit that thumbs up. It helps us out a lot. And if you want to see more Tech Radar videos, you can click just up here. You can subscribe just down here. And remember, for all the latest tech news and reviews, head to techradar.com.